Donald Trump, and all of America, could spend the next 18 months, or longer, engrossed in Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg's trial of the ex-president, and that could bring the trial close to Election Day. That's according to a former prosecutor in the Brooklyn District Attorney's Office, Charles Coleman, who is now a civil rights attorney and MSNBC legal analyst. Asked by MSNBC's Chris Jansing, how long typically might a case like this take? Coleman offered a two-tiered answer. A case like this is usually going to take a year or a year and a half, Coleman said. That could be through September of 2024. Wow, a surprise Jansing replied. So it's going right up into the campaign. Absolutely, agreed Coleman. But it's important to understand I said a case like this. This particular case, I expect may take longer because I am anticipating a number of different legal maneuvers by Donald Trump's defense team. That theoretically means into October of 2024, or longer. I do see motions to dismiss at a number of different terms, more likely than not to the point that the judge probably will ultimately end up admonishing them and telling them stop filing motions to dismiss. I think that that's going to happen, Coleman explained. I've said before, and I'll say again, I do believe that we are going to see an attempt to try to change the venue, in this case outside of somewhere in the five boroughs. All of that is going to extend the time deeper and deeper into election season. Reuters agrees, reporting Friday morning, any potential trial is still at minimum more than a year away, legal experts said, raising the possibility that the former U.S. president could face a jury in a Manhattan courtroom during or even after the 2024 presidential campaign, as he seeks a return to the White House. And because Trump's case is far from typical, Reuters notes, his trial could extend past Election Day in November 2024.